Good evening from the bowels of Orlando. Normally we're in this area of Orlando for uh, general mission concerts like uh, Earth Day Birthday. <laughs> yeah. Today we're here for brand new haunt, Tales of Terror. The Wasteland. We got invited out, there's a little media sneak preview and we're gonna check it out and take you guys along. Like a nice little vendor setup back here. It's Michael Myers' house. So if things look dark and dingy and dirty and grimy behind me, that's because it's supposed to look that way. This is a brand new independent haunt this year, starting brand new this year. And the emphasis is on scaring you. This is not a little kitty haunt. Are you ready? Are you ready? The bug spray. We forgot the bug spray. <laughs> it's almost time. No eating or drinking inside of the trail. No forward facing cameras. We ask that you film selfie style. Do not touch the actors and they won't immediately touch you. Is everyone ready? Yes. yes. All right. We're going in. <laughs> Look who it is. Wow. Wondering how I knew who that was. <laughs> you gotta wonder about that for a while, aren't you? 
Oh my goodness. Oh my. Yo, you want to go to help me that cat, Kyle? Get it. Oh. Hey, is he still behind us? I think just I hope not. You want a little head? Oh. Oh boy. You better show your movement then. Yes, Mama. Uh, you snack? Oh. Uh, Oh wow. Oh, I'll be quiet. See what was going on? Oh. oh wow. Oh my goodness. Oh my. You're not gonna believe this. <laughs> Oh my god. Well, appropriately scary. I'm going to see that in my dreams. So we completed our walk through. What'd you think? I thought it was great. I think it was really great. A um, couple really terrifying moments there with jump scares, and I again can't see with the light in front of me, but yeah. Wow. Yeah. The devil girl. Oh my in the God! In the the lights, fog. the light swamp. Yeah. Know? The laser. Laser uh, swamp. swamp. Like, That's what it, yeah. Holy shit. That was. She looked awesome. amazing and, the, and just foreboding when you just walk in and you're like, whoa. What a terrifying visual. <laughs> yeah, it is. Also, we've made a couple of friends in the haunt industry here, so <laughs> yeah. I'm not sure everybody gets the same level of treatment, but <laughs> he just won't stop. He's fantastic. So it was really cool. That was a really cool experience. So everything is behind this black tarp, but you can hear as the people go through, everyone's screaming. Oh my goodness. So I should note as you hear other people going through, you can opt in to have a glow necklace, which allows the actors to touch you and interact with you more than just jumping out and scaring you. So they do have zombie jelly ball as an option here as well. We have a little course and you could shoot little jelly balls at the zombies. Zombies. All right, so that was zombie jelly ball. All right, so we're back home, Tales of Terror. Back on the couch. Last thoughts. It was good. This was a soft opening tonight. Mm -hmm. um, so they... St <laughs> Eddie, <laughs> Eddie uh, <laughs> wishes he had joined us. Um, they, they still have another build. <laughs> they have more build to go. <laughs> what is so fascinating there, guy? 
they still have more build to go. Um, they literally uh, <laughs> se- I'm sorry. they secured the spot for where the hunt is. I think they said September the first, 1st. Yeah, like the first week of September. September 1st um, at the fairgrounds. And uh, their goal ultimately is to have um, a hunt in a permanent location where they um, have, um, they have the own their own the grounds yeah. that they own. Um, so, um, their goal is to also not be a cookie cutter, um, hunt and be a little bit more, um, grainy and gritty some, and gory, yeah. all of that good stuff. Um, no animatronics. They want it to be character driven. <laughs> Looks like the cat has been like hitting the catnip. <laughs> so, um... It, it was a it was a great experience. Um, it was a relatively short walkthrough, which, by the way, um, you know. So I thought about pricing, and again, um, Tales of Terror had us out tonight for a sneak preview. Tonight's cost, if you were going through as a paying consumer, would have been ten dollars for their soft opening weekend, so that they can get feedback from everybody mm-hmm. and work out the kinks. And they were literally asking everybody on the way out of the haunt, like what they liked, what they didn't like, and things like that which is great uh, to get feedback. Normally, the trail will cost uh, about $15 to go through. And considering, like, it was really good. They, it was, for us to get through the trail, it was about almost six minutes altogether, like mm-hmm. five and a half, six minutes. And when we asked Ash, the owner, um, the goal was to get through the haunt sometime around between, like, between four minutes and ten minutes, mm-hmm. um, depending on your speed. And if you're wearing a glow necklace, your interactions will last um, potentially longer than if you're not. So, uh, you know, if they physically interact with you. They're not hurting you at all. So don't think that. Like, we've done the glow necklaces before. But, but they ironically, do a extra. one yeah. of the things that we gave them as feedback tonight was that we didn't know that the glow necklaces were even... Uh, a An thing option. until we saw people walking around with them and it just seemed like you know at the beginning operationally they were a little confused about things so i'm sure they'll work out the kinks they're open through the end of the the month so they'll be there for halloween mm-hmm. and uh you know they've done home haunts historically so and then they did something at mannequins which we did a video at mannequins when they first opened up in sanford florida their bar that's located across the street from throwbacks, uh, throwbacks one of our favorite bars and uh great great experience great you know it's it's halloween it's it's a great stop for halloween you could do it on the way to horror nights mm-hmm. you know or after horror nights if it's too busy and so forth but in any event we need to get out of here thanks a lot for coming along thank you very much for all of your likes comments and subscriptions treat others the way you want to be treated look at this guy <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you guys have a good night <laughs>